Seven-year-old Rockland boy is recovering from a skull fracture after he was pelted in the head with a rock while riding the school bus. Another child is charged in the attack. News 12's Carol Wilkinson has more on this story that some in the community are calling a hate crime. It happened on Friday afternoon at about 12.30 aboard this bus as it traveled along Madison Avenue in Spring Valley, carrying students from the United Talmudical Academy. Police say a rock thrown by a 12-year-old African-American boy came crashing through the window. Shmuel Orlansky is general manager of transportation for the school. and He says rocks have been tossed at the Academy's buses before, but without injuries in the past. Since this is occurring numerous times, I would definitely link it to a hate crime, not just, you know, teenagers gone wild for a day. So far, the 12-year-old faces misdemeanor, reckless endangerment charges. But for some in this community, those charges just aren't harsh enough. Some people are obviously uh, have hate in themselves. Hasidic journalist Yasi Gestiner believes more can be done to promote peace among all members of the Spring Valley community, regardless of race or religious beliefs. I think a more constructive way would be for, uh, let's say, police officials to go, to go speak with, with uh, the younger classes about this, the seriousness of, of, of crime mm -hmm. and the seriousness of, of people needing to live you know, side by side in peace instead of fighting around. Meanwhile, the seven-year-old who underwent surgery Friday night at Westchester Medical Center is reportedly back at home with his family. Police say the 12-year-old told them that he was simply throwing rocks with his friends and did not mean to hit the bus. In Spring Valley, Carol Wilkinson, News 12. Carol, thanks for that report. And the 12-year-old boy charged in the attack is expected to appear in family court sometime this week.